Welcome back. This is Betty. She's one of our students here at Elegant Dancing and will be our partner for the Silver Smooth routine. We're going to start. This is our first one. Here we go. One, two, three, 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 one, two, three. You will now dance with an explanation at a break now. We're going to begin the routine facing the diagonal wall. We're going to start in a closed hold. We'll come back to that in a little while. We're going to begin dancing the, pro the progressive twinkles, or progressive open twinkles. But right now, we're going to be keeping everything small due to the space in the studio, but it should be as larger in real life. Do a twinkle to the right outside, to the left outside. We underturn, and it's going to have to right turn. Twinkle to the left outside, and it's going to finish. From here, we're going to go into our grapevine. If you're running out of space on the last dance, this can be cut, but most, if you start the quarry, you will need it to finish the wall. One, two, three, one, two, three. It can be repeated if necessary, and from here, we go into the open, the open right turn. Twinkle on the left. In open right, tip it its turn, and mark letter finish. We're now facing that a wall, a short wall, ready to start with that. Ready to uh, start the next wall. We'll now demonstrate with the music. I'll go over some variations we can use for this. So generally, this is, these routines are intended as a starting point, as we said in the introduction, but there are ways we can add some variety to them. So an easy way we can do it, get variety, is by changing our hold. Instead of starting in a closed position, we can begin in an open position with a double hand hold. The hands will be at about shoulder level, possibly a little bit lower. I turn just one hand and take the other as we move, or I can start with the double hand. We go. One, two, three. One, three. One, turn. Three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. The same figure, but it takes on an additional characteristic. So we can add further embellishment by putting an underarm turn on the feather finish. We could likewise make some changes to the um, open right turn at the end. We could replace the open right turn with a hairpin from Promenade, uh, from the A a natural fall away as seen with the Fox Trot syllabus, or really any other stuff to go around the corner. So don't be afraid to play around with this. Practice that, and we'll see you in part two for the short walk.